Hi everyone, welcome back to Coding Ninja YouTube channel. Myself Rajat Rawat, and in this video, we'll be talking about some general mistakes which we did while learning data structures and algorithms, and we need to uh, figure it out, and we don't need to do those things, right? So first and foremost, uh, thing which we can do, suppose we have uh, seen a question from uh, from a video, right? We understand the question. Now we directly jump on to coding the problem rather than dry running it. First, we need to dry run that problem, that uh, that thing, uh, that approach which we have figured it out via video. We dry run it, and then we basically code it, right? So that's a good thing to do, so that we are able to understand what things are going in the back in that approach or algorithm. Second thing is what we do whenever our uh, solution got submitted on the online judges platforms, then we directly move on to next uh, problem. Rather than that, we need to see the follow-ups. Sometimes there are follow-ups on the lead code platforms and all platforms like this. On Coding Ninja, also there are some follow-ups which ask that can you solve this with the help of constant extra space? Can you, or can you solve this with the help of order of n time complexity? Or uh, suppose we have uh, submitted our solution, but that solution is not optimized. So we need to see that uh, whether there is an optimized approach exists for that question or not. Third thing is that whenever uh, the question is not uh, done, uh, we can't be able to do then we just give up. Rather than giving up, we just take a pause, think about it more and then or we can take a break, right? Then come back and then again start working on that question. Or if you don't know, then you can watch the video and then again try it. But don't skip that question. That will break the momentum, right? Rather than going to next question, first finish that question and then go forward. Rather than skipping that question. So there are some general tips which we can do while learning data sets and algorithms which will definitely improve your problem solving skills. That's all about the video. If you have any doubts, you can ask in the comment section. Thank you and have a nice day. Hi there. Before we proceed further in the video, I would like to inform you that Coding Ninjas has come up with a scholarship test called CNSAT. If you participate in this test, you can avail up to 100% scholarship on any course at Coding Ninjas. It can be DSA, web development, product company interview preparation, and even data science and many more courses. So if you want to participate, click on the link in the description below or the pinned comment and participate now. Happy learning, guys. Thank you.